Maybe there's a secret button that lets it fly? Oh yeah, I think, I think this is what it is. We're here in Athens, Greece. They brought us to a private test drive area. We're about to meet the car for the first time. I'm still hoping for flying cars. There are ceilings in here, yeah. so I'm guessing that we're gonna be limited to the ground. Although it might be a hover car. That's true. Just like two feet it's off like, the ground? Like two feet off the ground. My name is Stefan Rileski. I'm uh, working at Toyota Europe. Today we'll be driving the Aero. It's a highly compact, three-wheel, zero-emission, front-to-drive, personal mobility vehicle. It's not meant to replace your normal car, but it's really meant to complement public transportation and uh, a car so that you can really do the, the last mile of your journey with, with the with the I road. I'm dying to know, can they fly? I wish you could. <laughs> I wish you could. I'm in the back seat right now. <laughs> it's, it's a, a bit more. It's a strange position. Actually, the car is already on. Oh, it so is. Normally, when you start, the car is going to balance, to tilt, and to, to fit the weight on the middle. This is a drive better in order to go forward. Oh, man, the way the back sweeps out like that. Oh. It's like riding a bike. Just taking it nice and slow the first time. Wow, this is what, like, 10-year-old Ben dreamed of when I was driving around my little Power Wheels car. <laughs> Speed it up. This is, I feel like I'm in the future. Oh, Woo! Go hit the cone. Oh, oh hit, hit the cone. The cone. Take care of me, Evan. Oh, <laughs> oh no, the, the way it like slides. I know. It's like riding a snowboard. Oh man, this is so fun. All right, let's see what you got, Evan. Right. Got it. Okay, oh. all right. All right, the cars didn't fly. Are you let down? I'm not we let down. We did not fly, but the cars felt like we were flying. It reminded me of the way a boat just kind of smoothly turns. It felt like butter. We're in the future now, right? Yeah, I felt like I was driving straight out of iRobot or one of those futuristic movies. That's definitely one of the most fun driving experiences I've had. I felt like a kid.